Hey everyone, Uta Vulture here. Welcome back to the channel. Today we'll be playing some more Cyberpunk 2077 and Update 2.0. But first, going to go through my monitor and game settings. Now, as I go through monitor settings, it's worth noting, especially for new viewers, I make two versions of every video: a POV version and screen recorded version. Uh, POV version is me filming the monitor with the camera, which is why you can see the monitor settings. Uh, it's worth noting that that is the only video where you will see my monitor settings that are currently on screen. Now, depending on which version of the video that you're watching right now, you can find it, the alternate version linked down in the description below. Now, having gone through monitor settings, going through game settings here real quick, uh, playing with everything almost maxed out. Uh, the only thing I've switched is uh, on-screen space reflections. I've, I've turned those down to ultra instead of psycho. Uh, DLSS set to balanced um, and not using path tracing here. Again, I, I have my RCX 3090 hooked up to the computer right now and uh, just from a hardware perspective, uh, path tracing with how intensive it is, I, I it, it's playable, but I have to turn DLSS to ultra performance. And so, uh, again, it's a super blurry image and particularly uh, it doesn't look very good, at least with the uh, the ray reconstruction when having, uh, at least I've noticed, when, when using uh, DLSS all the way to ultra performance. Now, excited to jump back into this game, uh, playing an entirely new character here, uh, not... Actually, let me go grab my vehicle real quick. Um, playing an entirely new character here. Uh, decided to kind of follow uh, the dev's advice, especially with the update, um, to do this. So uh, definitely, I, mean, I would recommend it as well. Uh, this game is, honestly, it's a completely new game now. Uh, it's it's awesome to see. Um, let me make sure I don't use this. Okay. Uh, it's awesome to see. Um, again, just, there's so many changes here, particularly in terms of character builds, uh, how, how combat plays out, uh, the vehicle system, especially actually having like an online system now. Um, just overall, oh wait, he's gonna hit me when I, when I do this, I forgot. Um, here, let me get in real quick. Yep. <laughs> I forgot about the, De the Delamain side missions. What the hell happened? Looks like everyone in this fucking town's out to end you. Makes me feel like an amateur. A hack. Ugh, shut up. Gotta find out why Night City's most courteous is upgraded to hit and runs. Probably couldn't stand you anymore either. I said, shut up. Here, I'll call her back in just one sec, but... Yeah, overall, again, this game is, uh, it really is, just, it feels completely different, and I'm, I'm super excited to play through this game again. Uh, I've been wanting to do a new playthrough ever since they announced what they were doing with Update 2.0. Um, so just, it's going to be, uh, again, if, if it's if you haven't played this game in a while, or honestly, maybe even if this is your first time, uh, this is the, the perfect time to jump into this title. Um, again, I mean, even from a random encounter standpoint, when just kind of doing the... Uh, uh, what do you, I guess we call it the, uh, the prologue, um, kind of getting through the initial introduction before you're really thrown out into the city. I mean, I had, I was already running into random events. I accidentally got into a police, uh, pursuit. Um, I mean, it just, again, everything about it felt, felt great. It felt different. It makes the city feel more alive. So let's see with that. Ah, do I want to, you know, can I... Do it in front of a bunch of police. I guess this will be a show off of how it looks. Roger dispatch. What else is new? We'll be right there. All right, let's see if I can get away. Suspect's vehicle has been located. Details have been sent. No, no, no. They're behind me. Hopefully, I can stay out of their range. If you look at the top right, you'll be able to see that up on the mini map. They actually kind of, kind of like with the with the, a game like GTA, for example. They have a, a, a cones, like vision cones, and you can kind of get, if you can get out of their range, then you can kind of start a, escaping the law, so to speak. Um, oh, uh, let's stay this way. Nice. Ah. Nice, got a new ride, technically. Here, let's kind of head in the direction of uh, meeting with Takamura. I'm not going to go meet with him yet. I just want to see and explore the city. Uh, see if I can find any random events going on. Ooh. 
it's also interesting. So now the, with the new HUD, uh, it marks all the police on your screen, kind of right on the gate. And unlike before, you're actually able now to uh, to scan and uh, and quick hack them. So again, just by uh, uh, I guess because they're they're ultimately seen now as uh, combatants and AI that you can interact with. Uh, and even on, again, even on your map up at the top right, uh, they're shown uh, again just like a game like GTA. They're either shown other location and kind of where they're they're either walking or, or driving around at. Oh. Let's see. Let me pull the map up real quick. Let me see if there's any anything that they need to do. Here, you know what? Let's go ahead and engage with one of these side jobs. Where's the stairwell at? Here, actually, here. So, 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 so you have an NCDP officer here. So again, you can scan and actually kind of run through a uh, quick hacks. Again. Something that is new uh, wasn't part of the uh, the original uh, uh, game. You I, you couldn't actually really do a quick hack other than just scanning them and seeing their information. You know, I didn't realize I was right next to the afterlife. Let's actually talk to her about Jackie. A chulo bowl with the bun? Yeah, I'm sorry to hear. Remember his drink? The recipe? Vodka on the rocks, lime juice, and ginger beer. And a splash of love. That's right. And the drink's name. Jackie Wells. Right. Well. First Jackie Wells is on me. This side mission is. You must think completely. Hey, for what interested in some work? Doing you know what? A business opportunity. Cargo yeah, transport. No Get from A to B, quick and quiet. Interested? I'm listening. It's simple. You go to the Kabuki waterfront, collect the package, give me a call, and then I tell you how to deliver. Very straightforward. Now look. Yeah. Everything except my pay. Don't worry, there's a bonus in it for you. Imported and duty free. Duty free and detail free. Yes, but altogether fair. It's a simple job, generously compensated. Do you accept? Yeah, sure, I'm in. Good, I knew we'd find acceptable terms. Head to the Kabuki waterfront, then search for a fridge with the words, no future. Nope, oh, ice. Once you locate it, Collect what you find inside, then call me for further instructions. Till then, I guess. I, I think this is the mission where you go in to uh, save a doctor. I'm pretty sure that's what this one is. I'll go see if I can find it. But first, I'll explore some other uh, gigs or missions that are in the area. One thing I think also of note, especially with the with this game, and again the changes that they've made. Um, actually, hold on, let me go see if I can take one of these cars. Ah. Nice. Um, but one thing is again about the game and it's uh, just overall improvements. Um, there's a level of clarity to the game, like uh, visual clarity, that uh, I don't recall uh, seeing it in previous versions. I don't know if that's just due to overall improvements to DLSS. Or anything like that, but I've always not, not that the game was blurry, but again that, that there was always noise. Oh wait, this is the game. Hold on, this is the, my car the way that, that I had originally had taken. Um, but now again, driving around and playing it, I, I do uh, note. Uh, I, th I think it's pretty obvious that there's a uh, enhanced visual clarity to the to the game itself. Oh, let's see what else is there. That's Takamura. Also, for anyone who obviously is a fan of Cyberpunk and, and is perhaps playing right now. Let me know down in the comments what your preference is in terms of, and how you like to play in terms of first person versus third person, uh, especially driving. Well, actually driving is the only way you could, you can make the switch unless you have a mod, but um, I'm trying to kind of play this game more often with uh, actually using first person driving. It, it has been uh, different trying to get used to it, but uh, I, I do like it, uh, starting to like it from an immersion standpoint. Oh wait, this is in my building actually. This is, I th um, let me see if I find something else. Hold on, I can't see. Let me play this way first. 
Oh, sorry. Oh, get around per. Oh, well, we're gonna hit him too. <laughs> nice. Oh, this guy. I was. <laughs> this side mission's always been hilarious. Hey, hey, you! I gotta get to a Ripper, man. I. No! I'll pay you. All right. Great. Why are we standing here? Let's let's go. We gotta hurry. Uh, satisfaction guaranteed. Let me guess, Mr. Stud XCV19 series. Uh, yeah. How'd you know? I know my implants, including the black market stuff. It's a good thing I got All a fast car here. Got recalled. Oh no no no! Oh no! Our luck. Really got to keep yelling like that. You don't even know how much it hurts. Like I'm screwing a goddamn pencil sharpener. Well, ah! oh well, driving slow. For in silence, Chew. Heard what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Real fucking funny. Hey. Oh, careful. Listen. <laughs> I didn't get him. Okay, we're. Hey, you after? I'll call you. But. <laughs> like I said, this side mission was always hysterical. Oh, hold on, there's a... Uh, who's over here? Who is this? Is this... Oh, more Maelstrom. I'm not the biggest fan of these guys. Let's, uh... Let's see what I have. I don't have any ammo there. I actually have no ammo at all. Hold on, I think I, I did pick up shotgun ammo out of... Here, let's do a few things. Let's see, is he? Oh, he's still there. All right, perfect. Nice. Or maybe I can actually pick up some ammo too while I'm here for some of my handguns. Ooh, Liberty, actually, that, go ahead and take that. There we go, perfect. Did he get some ammo? He should be okay. Nice, okay, this is, hopefully gave me some stuff I can use. Let me double check. Um, but yeah, with that, again, the, the combat in this game honestly feels a lot better as well with this update. Like, everything about it just feels punchier. Um, it's uh, something, actually, on a similar vein, I've noticed, even, like, from a car, uh, car damage uh, modeling perspective, I feel like they made improvements to this or, or, or definitely exaggerated and changed it. Um, just because, like, even just in general, like, car impacts, getting into accidents, things like that, result in more, what I think is more physical uh, body damage, so... Uh, again, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to find more details on that, but overall it does seem like that. Though that's part of the changes that they made here. But uh, combat certainly does, de uh, or definitely does feel uh, different. It feels better. Uh, it feels better to engage it. Enemy reactions and AI definitely seem to be smarter, um, especially compared to, you know, this game's launch date. Oh, here we go. What are the, these guys up to? And who is this? More Maelstrom. Okay, let's go ahead and... Easy enough. Wait, is there any more? Oh, that, he's showing one more. Where's the other? Oh, there they are. Nice. Anything worth picking up? 
Um, I already have a power submachine gun. I'm good with that. I definitely want to see if I can find some. Uh, uh, well, actually, I need to find the uh, the, the smart. Uh, I forget what the the specifically what the mod is called, but it allowed me to connect to tech weapons. All right. Well, with that, I think I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. Uh, again, really enjoying just playing this game, exploring everything that it has to offer. So uh, let me know down in the comments what you guys have th been thinking, especially with this update and if you've started a new character or not. But with all that, I appreciate you guys for watching. Please don't forget that like button and subscribe, and I'll talk to you later.